Welcome to Atlanta for the running of the Advocare 500. I'm Joel Skuska, and I'm your full coach today's race. Starting on the pole is Frey Bedford, and on the outside is Dom Cap. Samuel Smith is third. 875309 is fourth. And running our top five is Daniel Smith. So the pace car is going to dive into pit row, and we will get set for 14 laps here at Atlanta. Boogie, boogie, boogity. Atlanta racing, boys. Jimmy Belro is peeking out, trying to get the most spots he can. Because, remember, Frey Bedford is our points leader. If he wins this race, he's going to maximize it. Oh, trouble! Wreck! Caution is out. Frey Bedford leads them back. And who spun Lowe's 548 fan? That is the big question. Let's see what happened. Well, it looks like Julian Wilson got into Jason Van. Van came down, so if anything, I would blame Julian Wilson for that. But I think it was just a racing accident here on lap one. They're just going so fast. And I, I don't believe anyone will ever tire from this. But you never know. <laughs> So we'll go back green this time. Freddie Bedford, our race leader. Our points leader also. Kyle Payne. Haven't talked about him much this season. Green flag. Man, Freddie Bedford's so good at restarts. Going through the pack. Here comes Jamie Bellrose. Amanda Shelley for third. Gonna get it. And Bellrose in the middle. Three wide. Takes his him at 309. That was close. Oh, look at the run that Dom Caps and Nat Wagner got. Bell for the lead. Kyle Payne. Underneath Freddie Bedford. And 867-5309 is following. Freddie Bedford's starting to lose Fox. That's what Jamie Bellrose wants to see. Can Bellrose get back up there? Bedford to the inside line now. Bellrose back on the inside. Four wide almost. And now Bellrose is going to be stuck on the high side again. Bell for the lead. 8675309 is just taking it. Here comes Fred, Freddie Bedford back. But now Samuel Smith is going to get underneath him. Where is Bellrose? All the way back there. Bellrose slipping back. Tough. Julian Wilson underneath Angel Navarro. Angel Navarro, of course, locked into the chase because of that all-star win. Three wide. Freddie Bedford up top. That was close. Kyle Payne almost made contact. Again, if... I think some of these drivers are going to give Frey Bedford and Jamie Bellrose a little bit more respect on the racetrack since they know they are the points leaders. Samuel Smith is catching. 8675309. Three laps of racing to go. Samuel Smith trying to nail these corners. Look at him. He is catching 8675309. But 8675309 has one of the fastest laps, but will Samuel Smith's laps be faster? Two laps of racing to go. Now it looks like Samuel Smith's falling back. It looks like he might have given it his all. He's going to fall back to the cars that are battling. White flag is up. Final lap for 8675309. Yes, yeah, Samuel Smith's falling back to the battle here. 8675309 out of the corner. He has the lead. Through turns three and four. Nothing will happen. 8675309 will win the Admiral Care 500. And a big mess coming to the start finish line. There is our points leader finishing.
there is Jamie Bell Rose in the twenties. Where's Nat Wagner? A solid fifteenth. So here you finish your results for top twenty eight. And the rest of your field. Congratulations to eight six seven five three oh nine on locking up his chase spot. Here are your point standings. Freddie Bedford leads Jamie Belrose now by a lot. Nat Wagner Samuel Smith, Dom Caps, Sam Costine, Tom Shelley, Amy Shelley, the Mason Rose twelve, and Amanda Shelley. And now eight to seven five three nine is our wild card. He's locked into the chase, and so is Angel Navarro. So if eight six seven five three oh nine gets into that top ten, the wild card will be the person with one win, not unless they get a second win. And here's some more of your points. And your final points. So next race will be the Federated All Parts 400 at Richmond. Make the chase, boys. See you guys then.